What's going on, everybody? My name is Tree Gaming, and welcome to Payday 2. And today we got a very special thing here in Payday 2. We got not only mods, we also got. I'm not gonna say. We're gonna do it. So we're gonna just start off with the Mall Crasher, which was the first heist that we were given, and we're gonna we're gonna play it, and we're gonna we're gonna play it normally, you know, perfectly. Normal gameplay here. So as you can see, I got ducks here on my loading screen. That's pretty cool. Yep. Alright, so if you look here in loadout, uh, if you ever played Payday before, you would know that normally you can switch your weapons. I cannot. I have these set weapons that were given to me, and these are the weapons that I'm gonna have to use. I can buy other stuff. I'm gonna buy ammo bag and doctor bag, and we're just gonna get right in there. Go into the mall. I'm gonna skip that. We're gonna go. Now, are you ready? This is what I have done. Okay, that's not the staircase. This. This video might make you blind. It's very hard to see anything. And so, yeah, this video, I'm playing with the Mad Planet filter. Now what this does is it makes it black and white, and it's very hard to see anything. Okay. So in this heist, your job is to destroy as many things as you can. Just destroy everything. I mean, that's exactly what I'm doing right now. I'm just beating stuff up with a, a bottle of alcohol. Scotch, probably. Bottle of whiskey. Okay, going back. So apparently there might be a bulldozer down there. Yeah, there he is. Okay, we are taking some heavy damage here. So our goal is to not die. Okay, well, I'm blind now. As if I wasn't already. Okay. Now, all we gotta do is just destroy more stuff. There, as you could, as you should have seen, we were stuck on the stairs, and that must have, that wasted, um, a lot of time that we could have been breaking stuff. And I'm pretty sure the cops will continue to break stuff for us, so we don't really need to break glass and stuff like that. But, these wine bottles, I don't really think they'll be lucky enough to shoot them, so... Because they're not going to be aiming for the stuff, they're not trying to help us complete the heist, they're trying to stop us from completing this heist. Our job is to complete the heist, and break everything that we can. See, we're already at 15 grand, our job is to get to 50,000. So now all we gotta do is break all of this. I'm gonna switch real quick and reload first. Now I got this idea from my friend who, when he downloaded Payday, 
he had accidentally had this filter on and didn't even know the entire time. So he just thought that this was what the game looked like. And I thought, well, that would be really easy, but I already know what the game looks like. So I just turned on the filter, and I'm just playing it like I normally would, you know? I'm not trying to claim that I don't know what the game looks like, because I, I certainly do know what the game looks like. I'm not very good at the game. I don't like, I'm not like, national material. Pretty sure that guy was. So, I also have random modifications. Not like I can really see what modifications I have. But I have them. This should be a really quick heist. It should be really, really quick. See, as you can, if you can see at the top, whenever this, whenever the top is dark, and not pit, pure white, pitch white, you will be able to see the time that we've spent on the heist. So we, right now we spent five minutes. Hopefully, I'm, I'm hoping that we can spend less than ten on this heist. It shouldn't take us that long. If it does, then... I'm just not using good time management. A lot of these bottles are missing. So that's unfortunate. That means that we, we can't really break as much as we normally would if the bottles were there. Okay, that was already gone. See, this is where you can get some extra cash, and also I can just kind of not go in the window. That's cool. I have a pretty okay loadout, not the best. I could have been better. Okay, so here we can access, we can put our drill up, but I don't really think we need that. I think we're fine. Okay, we do, we've done, we're done, we're done, we're done, we're done, we're done. Now all we gotta do is either drill some stuff, or just kinda sit in the room and wait. I, mean, I think I'm going to try and set up some of the drills. I'm going to go grab some jewelry real quick from over here. If I can make it there. And at the end of the episode, for anyone who's wondering what build I'm using, I will show it. those of you who are here like, wow, he's really good at the game if he's able to tell where everything is. I'm really not. Okay, he's going to be here in a minute, so I think that's all I'm going to grab. The bad thing about this is that I can't see when the drills are supposed to be done. We're still waiting for the helicopter. And apparently it's almost here. Go ahead and make a run for it. We do have a sniper. Got him. And now we're done. Overkill. Enough said. See you at the safe house. 
Whoa, thank you, Andis Mandis, for joining the tree army. That was kind of random. But I gotta say, thank you, thank you so much for joining the, the tree army. This is not a live stream, so I don't know why you joined, but thank you so much. Okay, well, this is a, I know this is a short video for you guys, but, you know, sometimes I can't really make the videos as long as I, I need to, because I got stuff to do, but if you guys enjoyed nonetheless, leave a like, subscribe, and comment. Please try not to forget about the challenges that we have for every week from now on, and yeah, I hope you enjoyed the episode. Bye-bye.